Hey what's going on guys, it's your boy Fano here, and in this CSGO video, I'm going to share with you the best CSGO skin from every collection. Generally, it's going to be like the most rarest, the most expensive of every collection, but not always. So make sure you guys watch until the end and let me know what you guys think, if you agree with my list or not. Well, let's see if we can get 1,000 likes on this video, that's going to be our video goal. Also, if you haven't subscribed already, please consider subscribing. It's free and it really helps me out, and you can always unsubscribe later. With that being said, let's hop right into this list the first skin i have for you comes from the norse collection and of course i had to go with the op gongnir big surprise there for the canals collection we got the awp prince obviously high tier skins right there most desirable ak-47 wild lotus is the best skin from the saint mark collection in my opinion wild lily does come close sg553 integral from the inferno 2018 collection gets my vote for that collection in the nuke 2018 collection we got a clock 18 nuclear garden i thought that looked the best had the best design even though it's not the rarest it's still my favorite the famas spitfire is the best skin from the alpha collection the scar 20 emerald also has a stake in the pie but i kind of prefer the spitfire's design a little bit more than the emerald personal preference i suppose and then moving on to the assault collection of course i had to go with a clock 18 fade i had to do it guys i mean what was i gonna choose a bulldozer for the Aztec collection, we got the AK-47 Jungle Spray. For the Baggage collection, we got the AK-47 Jet Set. Uh, some people might say, like, the Pilot is better, but... I think they're both really good high tier skins. This is the classified and the one and only classified skin from the baggage collection, so I had to go with it. And for the bank collection, we got a P250 Franklin, also a very, very nice skin from that collection. For the cash collection, we have a Galil AR Cerberus. And then moving on to the Chop Shop collection, we got an M4A1S Hot Rod. And obviously for Cobblestone, of course, the Dragon Lord tops the list there. Moving on to the Dust collection, we got a Desert Eagle blaze for the dust 2 collection however we have an r8 revolver amber fade and then for our gods and monsters collection we got the awp medusa and then the inferno collection the og inferno collection we got an m4a4 tornado clock 18 candy apple for the italy collection i think it's my favorite you guys thought i was gonna say pit viper but no candy apple for the win the best csgo skin from the lake collection is the awp safari mesh and then for the militia collection the best csgo skin there is the m4a4 modern hunt Hunter. If we move on to the Mirage collection, the best skin is the UMP45 Blaze. The Nuke collection, the OG Nuke collection, the best skin is the M4A4 Radiation Hazard. For the Office collection, we got an MP7 Whiteout. In the Overpass collection, the M4A1S Masterpiece takes the cake. But as for the Rising Sun collection, I had to go with the Aug Akihabara Except. Please don't call me a weeb. And then for the Safe House collection, we got an M4A1S Nitro. In the Train collection, the best skin there is an M4A4 Urban DD Pat. In the Vertigo collection, the AK-47 Black Laminate is the best, in my opinion. For the Fracture case, we got a Desert Eagle Prince Stream. I went with the Prince Stream. Pearlescence for the win. And then moving on to the Prisma 2 collection, the M4A1S Player 2 has my vote. The Shattered Web collection, the Op Containment Breach is the best skin there. For the CS 20th Anniversary case, the AWP Wildfire is the best. The M4A4, the Emperor, is the best skin in the Prisma collection. The Op Neo Noir is the best skin in the Danger Zone collection. For the Horizon Collection, the best skin is the AK-47 Neon Rider. For the Clutch Collection, the best skin there is the M4A4 New Noir. For the Arms Deal Collection, a very old CSGO case or collection, we got the AK-47 Case Hardened being the best, obviously. And then for the Arms Deal 2 Collection, I have the SSG-08 Blood in the Water being the best skin there. We got for the Arms Deal 3 Collection, the CZ-75 Auto Victoria. In the Chroma Collection, we got the M4A4 Dragon King. The M4A1S Hyper Beast is the best skin in the Chroma 2 collection, and the M4A1S Chantico's Fire is the best skin in the Chroma 3 collection. The best skin in the Esports 2013 collection is the AK-47 Red Laminate. The Desert Eagle Cobalt Disruption is the best skin in the Esports 2013 Winter CSGO collection. And then for the Esports 2014 Summer collection, we got the AK-47 Jaguar being the best. The AWP Hyper Beast is the best CSGO skin in the Falchion collection. The M4A1S Mecha Industries is the best CSGO skin in the Gamma collection. For the Gamma 2 collection, we got the AK-47 
7 Neon Revolution. In the glove collection, we got the SSG-08 Dragonfire being the best. The AK-47 Vulcan is my favorite and I think the best CSGO skin in the Huntsman collection. And then the AK-47 Fire Serpent is the best CSGO skin in the Bravo collection. Come at me, bro. In the Breakout collection, the Glock 18 Water Elemental is the best. For the Hydra collection, the AWP on Haji is the best. For the Phoenix collection, we got the AWP Azimov being the best. And then for the Vanguard collection, the AK-47 Wasteland Rebel is the best CSGO skin there. AK-47 Fuel Injector has my vote in the Wildfire collection. And then for the Revolver collection, I think the R8 Revolver Fade fittingly is the best skin in that case. And then moving on to the Shadow case, we got a USPS Kill Confirmed being the best skin in that collection. In the Spectrum collection, the AK-47 Bloodsport is the best skin there. For the Spectrum 2 collection, the best skin is the AK-47 The Empress. And then for the Winter Offensive collection, the M4A4 Azimov is the best CSGO skin there. Let me know what you guys think of this list. For more CSGO skin videos, make sure you hit that subscribe button and check out the videos currently visible on your screen. I hope you have a great rest of your day. So until next time, this is Fano, signing out.